Today we are running HDPE, a high density polyethylene using the XTS19 trial line. This includes the XT19 twin screw extruder, top feeder, water bath and pelletizer. Our touchscreen HMI shows speed, torque and temperature details for improved control of the process. This can be logged and exported to enable comparisons between previous batches. Here you can see we are using a top feeder, but ExtraTech offer a variety of feeding options, including an XTS side feeder, featured on this machine, vibratory tray feeder and more. For highly accurate or valuable formulations, ExtraTech can also offer gravimetric feeders. The HDPE is extruded in continuous strands through our strand die and discharged into the water bath for cooling. The die is easy to change for cleaning, maintenance purposes or profile variations. Afterwards, the cooled strands exit the water bath where they are dried using our air knife. The strands are fed down the line to the XTS benchtop pelletizer where the strands are cut into 3mm pellets. Shafts, screw elements and liners can be cleaned and replaced easily with our clamshell barrel to simplify both maintenance and cleaning. The water bath has a recirculation option which features a pump and heat exchanger. This is particularly useful for long batches where heat removal is necessary. Alongside thermoplastics, the XTS19 is also suitable for other applications such as medical plastics, biopolymers, fine chemicals and pharmaceuticals. We can provide customised ancillary equipment such as air-cooled conveyors to replace the water bath for biopolymer applications and a range of additional ancillaries. This can include haul-offs, laser micrometers and multipoint liquid injection for viscous and non-viscous fluids. The XTS1942LD has a typical output of 20 kg per hour, but this is of course dependent on formulation with a screw speed of 900 rpm. There is also an option to scale up production with Extratex XTS24 and XTS35 extruder models.